Well, that's right. You know, experts have pointed out that while the stock market has had some wild swings, especially lately, that real estate, especially here on the seacoast, has not only remained steady but on the rise. And so there is investor confidence, as you pointed out, combined with location, location, location. Summer is usually the hottest time for Seacoast real estate sales, but 2015 has been sizzling. The Seacoast Board of Realtors includes 13 towns where a total 160 single family homes were sold in July. That's the most of any month since 2010. And though August was a bit lower at 122, it beat every other August going back 13 years. And not only volume records being set, but uh, medium sale prices going up and up. The median price rose every month, peaking in August at $420,000, the highest overall since 2010. The median price for condos, $250,000, beating every August in five years as well. Some very high ticket sales, too. This Newcastle home sold for $4 million last month, another in Portsmouth for six. Just off the high end market, the 700 to 1 million, which used to be kind of like the black hole of real estate, that's doing very well. Rice says it's well kept homes near that median range, close to water or downtown, that are garnering multiple offers. There's a word of caution, though, for the over eager. Well, we first overpriced the house uh, beyond what the market value was, uh, hoping to maybe you know find somebody who would uh, be willing to overpay for our house yeah. in Portsmouth in a great location. Yeah, didn't happen. Uh, no, has not happened. Five months later, they've lowered it, and action has really picked up. On the buying side, you have the the comfort of knowing you've made a great investment. On the uh, selling side, it's obvious. Uh, you, it's a good time to sell, it's a great time to sell. Well, and according to the Seacoast Board of Realtors, people continue to put their property on the market, and they say as long as there's inventory, there is interest. And so for now, though some a seasonal dip is expected, things are still going strong. Live in Portsmouth, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.